the London Gateway is a brand new deep water port on the uh, Thames, closest to the heart of consumption of the whole of the UK. Uh, what we're developing here is a new modern efficient container port capable of handling the new largest vessels in the world, plus also being closest to the heart of consumption of the UK, saving money to the end users and uh, taking trucks off the road. Well, the main reasons for choosing uh, N4, uh, largely it's due to uh, trying to find a, a, a product that's integrated with the equipment control system. So the, the advantage, the strength of having um, the cargo tech solution, Calmar on the one hand and, and Navis on the other, uh, working together was a, a strong selling point for us. And of course the other is the, um, the depth of experience in automation. So setting up a new automated terminal, we wanted uh, a TOS that has, uh, and a TOS provider that has a good experience in that particular um, domain. Okay, I think uh, one of the key points is uh, testing, testing, testing and testing. It's very important to um, test and we, uh, we rely on Navis to do a great deal of testing and then additionally we do testing in-house. Uh, the second part I guess would be uh, our project team from Navis helped a great deal. Uh, we had a, a, a good group that, uh, with good uh, balance of experience across the different areas, being a complex application. It, Different parts of the application require different pieces of knowledge and we had a, a team that came with a good spread of knowledge. Well, the Navis software is at the core of all of these. It's, uh, it's the centrepiece of, of everything, uh, right through from the gate flows, uh, there, there's a separate gate system, but that gate system in, interfaces with the Navis TOS and uh, the, the TOS is driving that process. Uh, through the, the ASCs, they're, they're an automated Kalmar product uh, and Kalmar drives the crane, but uh, Navis is making those decisions about which containers and where and, and how to minimise the rehandles and how to optimise the, the stacking. Across the, uh, the water side, Again, uh, the TOS is the centre with prime route, optimising dispatch with the shuttle carriers and finally to the key crane for stowage. And again, Navis is at the centre of, of that operation as well. So we're, we're on our way to meeting our goals. Uh, as a, as a start-up site, we've, we've started from virtually zero and we're moving towards uh, you know, full operational capacity. So.